Hi Libra, welcome to my channel Libra. I hope you are doing well Libra. I hope you are finding safe and doing good. This reading for today, it is for the Libra sign. Thank you so much Libra for supporting the channel. Thank you so much Libra for being here. If you would like to further connect with me Libra, please do click the bell. Click subscribe. Let us see what is your guided message, okay? What is the message for the Libra sign? Oh, you have a Ten of Cups. You have a Ten of Cups. You have an Ace of Cups. You have the Hangman. Okay, that's very interesting. You've got a Nine of Swords in here. What's coming towards you? A Hermit card. You could be dealing with a Virgo, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. Mm, seven of pentacles the queen of pentacles is here the four and the five of cups okay guys let's start your reading well first of all with the ten of cups and the ace of cups in here it feels like you could be in a memory lane okay um looking into the looking into the movement of the stars astrology wise we have an incoming full moon okay in the next i think two to three days from now we will have a full moon so this full moon is very intense it's the biggest i guess i think this is the biggest full moon in this year it's the closest to earth too so it is very intense and it's happening to the aries sign libra and um I feel like you are in a memory lane with the Ten of Cups, the Ace of Cups. It, it feels like it's connected to a twin flame, a soulmate. I get the feeling that this twin flame or soulmate or romantic energy, you had a baby with this person, but there was a miscarriage, okay? You are... It feels like lately you've been thinking about this person... For some of you, you know the 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 this the you know the 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 first reading was you know for some of you you were together you had a miscarriage and then you were separated because it could be because it's a ten of cups so it's possible that you were married with this person you had a long term relationship with them or for some of you it could be someone you dated of a twin flame and a soulmate because this is a strong bond you know the ten of cups is that um, you felt it's like a unanimous unanimous decision like it's a unanimous choice this is a twin flame this is a soulmate okay now you've been thinking about them recently or over the past 10 days at maybe a month like you would find yourself you know you could be cooking and then randomly this person's thoughts your you know you would be um you would find you would find yourself thinking about them you would be driving and you would find yourself their image would pop into your thoughts so it's because this person is connecting with you okay you've got the hangman this person is connecting to your psychic okay so there is a romantic interest who they haven't decided it but they've been thinking about you intensely this is a soulmate this is a twin flame you know it, it's like you would even you would even tell your friends you know that hey you know what I've been thinking about this person I don't know why and you're wondering why do I keep thinking about this person why do I see things connected with this person it might not be romantic it might be platonic for some of you guys but there is a lot of you know occurrences that sign synchronicity and symbolism leading you to remembering this person it's because they're telepathically contacting you and if this person if they haven't reached out it's because you brush them off okay it means that when you randomly you know come across something connected to them you just dismiss it but if you do think of them as well it could build up a strong force like it could it's like they think of you it's like this person is thinking of this is you the thinking of you okay and you brush it off so it's disconnected but if you do respond to them telepathically and you do intensely think of them it will build up in a strong vibe where they would reach out 
I guess this person is into, will I reach out? Will I not reach out? They're still searching for the answer, but there is, it's like a, it's like a budding, like a budding relationship. No, it's not a, like it's a, it's a, it's a, every day there's a nudge from their heart to reach out with Libra. Okay. Yeah. Queen of Wands. I mean, look at that. They remember your face. They remember your smell, your smile. They remember the amazing conversation. They remember you. Okay. Someone rem is remembering you, reminiscing you. And somehow it's connecting you to remember it to go into memory lane um and i'm looking at the the horsepower you know it's it's a joke in the philippines like you've got to have this horsepower like uh they are probably building up the vibe to connect to connect with you materialistically like to materialize it you know because energetically they want to but to actually in in a human calling you they're still figuring things out when will they do that the, the full moon could support them, okay? But there's someone who's intensely thinking of you and wanting to reach out, building, building the vibe. Libra, this person, they have a letter C. Letter C, an R, a T, an M, an S, and a Levi. Maybe they like L Levi. Levi's me. I don't know if you... If you compliment them about their pants but Levi's I'm saying the Levi's brand Levi's brand and Snoopy Snoopy like cartoon character is the cartoon character so I'm seeing those maybe this person is an artist or maybe they like cartoon um, all right now the second part of the reading hmm you know the nine of swords the hermit card you worry you worry about money for some of you for some of you guys okay where will i be seven years ten years from now what will i be where will i be what will be like sera, sera. what will be will be for you libra and it looks like you're going i'm seeing you if that's your like like nine of swords the hermit card you, like where will i be five ten years ten years from now where will i be son you worry about your you worry too much about the distance, distance future, that you're forgetting that the answer to your distance future is the now. The answer to your amazing future is the present. The key to an amazing future is now. What you, what you do now affects your future. What you don't do now affects your future too. So have a balance between thinking of now and how you plan your future because the key to your future is now. However, for some of you, I can, I'm seeing you walking the aisle. Hmm. Yeah. So I'm seeing you walking the aisle. Okay. For some of you, I'm seeing you having your own small business. For some of you, I'm seeing you relocate to another country. So if that's the theme of your, like, if that's the theme of your life, you know, what's, that's one of your priorities and the theme that you're building. I'm seeing you um, regenerate strength. For some of you, I don't know, maybe there's a health issue and stuff, but I'm seeing you regenerate your strength. I'm seeing you walk down the aisle. I'm seeing you small business, okay? I'm seeing you retiring, retiring early, and you would own a beachfront property. And I'm seeing you with... For some of you, I'm seeing you guys. I'm seeing you with um, wearing glasses. You're going to wear glasses. So if you are not protecting your um, eyesight right now, you might like, it's funny. Like I'm seeing you wearing glasses, reading glasses. For some of you, you are not going to live where you are. You're going to move. If you have a desire to move in another country, you will move. And for some of you, if you are like a baker or you will have your own bakery or coffee shop or something baking with a blue color. I don't know what's blue bell, if that's a flower, but I'm seeing you that. Maybe that's the brand, but I'm seeing you that. Okay. All right. Now I'm having a headache. <laughs> Too much image flashing. Now, 
Okay, so look, the key, hermit card, don't overthink about the future. Focus on now. Now is the key to your future. Yeah, the world card. Yeah, it's possible that you think you worry a lot. You are good. You're safe. Yeah, the page of swords. Like, try to filter out what you need to prioritize right now because if you try to do all of it in one thinking, you will be overwhelmed. What is your priority today? You know, like prioritize, filter out, streamline with the page of swords. You're very smart. Streamline your thoughts. Streamline your plan with the page of swords in here. Look at this person. She's wearing glasses. Um, okay. All right. For some of you, I'm kind of picking up that you would change your hair color to blonde for some of you guys. Okay. All right. Now, let's see what else is coming towards you. You have to save money. For some of you guys, if you feel like, oh no, I had, I need to save money to buy this. I need to save money for this. I need to save money. You need to save money. Um, there's something that you want to buy. Okay, I'm kind of picking up like, you want to buy this. You want to afford this. You want something that will involve money. Okay? And this is what you call predictive reading. Predictive reading is that I'm allowed... To tap into something to somehow warn you not warn you but give you a nudge that hey i'm predicting this and you can change the outcome so this is it's like a you have a permission to change this okay this is a guided message predictive reading so there's something that you want to buy there's something that you want to do there's something of a financial planning and i believe that you are already doing the financial plan the financial budget financial planning you need extra more money. You know, it's, a, for example, for example, Libra, you will buy a house. For example, okay, um, you're going to buy a house or maybe you're going to renovate your house. The budget you allocated, it's, need, it's needing more, five of cups, okay? So for some of you, you're being advised that if you have this big purchase, especially if you're targeting to have this next year, if next year you want to buy or purchase something, you want to spend something big purchase, whatever the amount you're wanting to prepare, you believe, okay, this is the amount, you know, four of pentacles, put an extra, save more, because you would be needing more. And that extra will firm the quality, okay? It's something, for example, okay, I want to buy a house. I want to buy uh, 500,000 worth, 500,000, you know, house worth, you will buy 700,000, okay? So, there's something that you would like to buy, save further more, because whatever you will save, you will be needing more. And there's something in here that you, there's a miscalculation, or it could be what you want, it's not exactly, like you pictured this is what I want in this demo, but you will, you will want more in the future, you will want something bigger and it will cost you. So when you plan, give it an extra padding, you know, for the for the money. Okay, the money that you're gonna save. Yeah, I'm saying three three three. But you're good. I'm looking at whatever this one, it could be a house, could be a business, but could be a jet. You're gonna buy a jet. But it's it's in the right timing. You're working hard, you've got the support. You're very focused onto this. I see you having a big purchase next year. Very nice. But it's not exactly what you want. It's the it's the higher. If, if for example, I want to buy a four bedroom. Okay, you're manifesting it, working hard. But in the actual buying, you will see something of a five bedroom. That's why you need you need to ex you need to have an extra money and you want to give it to yourself. Because five of cups, oh I really want that five bedroom. And I see you working to get that five bedroom. Okay. So save more for that um expense something of a big purchase okay and this is what i have for you libra thank you so much for supporting the channel thank you so much guys for being here if you would like to further connect with me libra you know what to do all you have to do is click the bell click subscribe i'll see you soon you have a great day